Hello. How is everyone doing? Today, we're going to show you how to install the Google Play Music app or Music Player in 2024. Nowadays, most phones come with the YouTube Music app, which can also be used as a music player. But if you're like me, you probably want to go back to using the old Google Play Music Player. To do that, the first thing we need to do is tap on the icon of the application. In this case, it would be YouTube Music. We'll go to where it says, App Info, and in this case, we'll have to uninstall it. But if it came pre-installed like in my case, there's no uninstall button. Instead, we'll tap on, Disable, where it says, Disable this app. Once that's done, we'll do the following. Open our web browser and go to the following page. Please note that YouTube doesn't allow too many links or what they consider spam, so take a few seconds to note this page. Once inside, click on the magnifying glass and search for the Google Play Music app. Press Enter, and in the results, click on the first one, which is the music player. On some phones, the latest version from October 2020 may not work. In my case, I recommend installing an older one, say from 2019 or 2018. So, we click on, see more, and we scroll down. I recommend one from, for example, February 2019. Click here and wait for the green button below to enable. Once enabled, click on, download, and now we wait a few seconds for it to download. Depending on your internet connection, it might take a few minutes or seconds. As we can see in the file name, it will download in a PK format, which means we'll have to grant permissions to install the app externally. In this case, we click Download anyway. Once the download is complete, click on the Install button. After that, click Open. Obviously, since this app is no longer available on Google servers, it won't be able to connect to the internet. So, we can use it as a local player for all the music on our phone. To do this, tap Allow, and it will access all multimedia files. As we can see, we have a couple of files and folders in which we can start playing our music. An important step, not necessary but you can do it just in case, is once the app is installed, go to the Google Play Store, search for Google Play Music, if you don't see the player installed, do the following. Go back to the main menu, tap on your profile picture. Go to Manage Devices and Apps and look for Available Updates. Here, search for Google Play Music. Tap on the icon or name to enter this menu. Tap on the three dots and finally, deactivate the Update Automatically option. This way, the app won't automatically update to YouTube Music, and you can keep using the classic Google Player on any Android phone. So, if you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe, and share it with your friends. I'm Sebas from Deal Matech, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.